Hello everyone. Welcome back to Cradle Roll Sabbath School. It's so good to see you all and I hope that you're all well and safe. We are in a new month. We're in the month of June. So we have a new program for you this month and I hope that you enjoy worshipping with us. Let's start our program together. It's lovely to come and be part of Sabbath School, isn't it? I'm so happy to see you all here. I wish that I could come and see you and give you a big hug through the screen, but sadly I can't. Did you know there's so many ways of saying hello to each other? For example, we could wave, we could give a big hug, we could give a high five, or we could go and shake someone's hand. Have you ever gone and shaken someone's hand? Is there anyone in the room that you could go and shake a hand with? We can go and sing Shake a Little Hand and welcome everyone to Sabbath School. So go around the room and shake everyone's hands. Are you ready? Shake a little hand and say good morning. Shake a little hand and say good morning. Shake a little hand and say good morning. We're glad you came to Sabbath School. Oh, wonderful. Did you greet everyone? Well, I think because we, I can't go and say hello to them, but how about you go and shake their hands for my behalf, yeah? Okay, let's sing one more time, ready? Shake a little hand and say good morning. Shake a little hand and say good morning. Shake a little hand and say good morning. We're glad you came to Sabbath School. Welcome to Sabbath School, everyone. Let's have a really good Sabbath together. Can someone tell me what day today is? Is it a Monday? Is it a Friday? What day of the week is today? It's a Saturday! And we like to come to Cradle Roll Sabbath School on Saturday, don't we? Now, is Saturday a sad day? I don't think it's a sad day. I think that Sabbath is a happy day, isn't it? Because we get to share Sabbath together. and We can come to church and enjoy worshipping God together with our friends and families. So, I need you to go find something that makes a loud noise. I have some things here that make a loud noise. Can you hear them? They're my clappers. So, I need you to go find something that's noisy. If not, why don't you use your hands to make a loud clapping noise? But once you have something, I always make a big noise. And we're going to sing, Sabbath is a happy day. Are you ready to sing and make a loud noise? Then let's go! Sabbath is a happy day, happy day, happy day. Sabbath is a happy day. I love every Sabbath. Good job everyone, what lovely noise you made. So where do we go to first on a Sabbath morning? We come to Cradle Roll Sabbath School, of course. So first we come to Sabbath School. First we come to Sabbath School. Sabbath School, Sabbath School. First we come to Sabbath School. I love every Sabbath. Good job. Then after Sabbath School, where do we like to go? We stay for church, don't we? Then we like to stay for church. Then we like to stay for church, stay for church, stay for church. Then we like to stay for church. I love every Sabbath. Good job. Now, I have a little secret. I get very hungry after church. Does anyone else get hungry? Oh, I'm glad I'm not the only one. Well, I think I'm going to use my clappers like cutlery and I'm going to have some lunch. Are you ready to have some lunch? Let's eat. Then we like to have some lunch, have some lunch, have some 
some lunch Then we like to have some lunch I love every Sabbath Good job! Now I need you to stand up and look out the window for me Can you tell me what the weather's like? Is it raining today? Is it snowing today? Is it windy? Or is it nice big glorious sunshine? Well, whatever the weather, I think we should go and take a walk. Shall we all go for a walk around the room? Ready? Then we like to take a is a happy day one more time I want you to clap really loudly are you ready Sabbath is a happy day happy day happy day Sabbath is a happy day I love every Sabbath keep going make lots of noise and stop well done Sabbath really is a happy day isn't it? Well done everyone for singing and clapping so loudly! Can you see what this beautiful thing is that I have hanging up here? What do you think it might be? That's right, it's a heart! We all have a heart don't we? Deep in here. Now I wonder who's inside of your heart. Shall we find out who's inside this heart? Let's open the doors to this heart. Who's inside of this heart? Can you say who that is? Who's inside this heart? That's right, it's Jesus. Now is Jesus in your heart? I hope and pray that he is. He's definitely in my heart. So I think we should sing into my heart. We're gonna ask Jesus to come into our hearts. Are you ready? Into my heart, into my heart, come into my heart, Lord Jesus, come in today, come in to stay. With Jesus in our hearts, do you think that our lives would look a little bit different? In fact, it would make us so much better. So we're going to ask Jesus to shine out of our hearts now. Are you ready? Out of my heart, out of my heart, shine out of my heart, Lord Jesus, shine out. everyone. It's wonderful to have Jesus in our hearts, isn't it? I think that it's time to talk to Jesus, don't you? So let's put our hands together, close our eyes and let's talk to Jesus. Dear Jesus, thank you for looking after us. Thank you for being with us and keeping us safe and that you love us, Lord, and Lord, we love you too. Please be with us and all the lovely children around the world and their families. Continue to protect us and guide us and keep us safe until we all meet again. In your name I pray, amen. Well done. It was lovely to talk to Jesus, wasn't it? likes to call people like you and me sheep.
because Jesus is our shepherd. He looks after us and he even comes find us when we're lost. So we should be like sheep. Can you do little sheep ears like this? And what noise does a sheep make? Can you think? Do they go moo? No. Okay. Uh, a sheep goes woof woof. No. What noise does a sheep make? Can you tell me? That's right. They go ba. So can you give me your little sheep ears and go ba? Because I just want to be a sheep. Ba ba ba. Like that. So let's sing our song together and I want to see all of my little sheep. Are you ready? I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. And pray my Lord my soul to keep. I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. I don't want to be a Pharisee. I don't want to be a Pharisee. Cause they're not fair you see. I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. And pray my Lord my soul to keep. I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. I don't want to be a Sadducee. I don't want to be a Sadducee. Cause they're so sad, you see. I just want to be a sheep. Ba, 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 ba. I just want to be a sheep. It's really important to stay nice and clean, isn't it? Especially keeping knees clean. What are these? Are these my feet? No, what are they? They're my hands. Good job. So my hands need to stay nice and clean. What do we do to keep our hands clean? We wash them, don't we? Now. Can you come and show me your hands so I can see if they're clean? Oh, I'm having a look. Are they nice and clean? I hope so. Are my hands nice and clean? Oh, that's good, isn't it? Because I washed my hands this morning. Can you scrub, 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 scrub? Because I washed my hands to give them to Jesus. Because Jesus uses my hands to do good things for him. Now. Shall we give our hands a big scrub when we sing I Wash My Hands This Morning? Are you ready? I washed my hands this morning so very clean and bright I gave them both to Jesus to work for him till night Little feet be careful where you take me to Anything for Jesus Are your hands nice and clean yet? Wait, they're not clean yet? Let me see. Show me your hands. Oh, I think they could be a little bit cleaner. How about we wash our hands again? What do you think? Let's give our hands a big scrub again. Ready? I washed my hands this morning so very clean and bright. I gave them both to Jesus to work for
and shiny. Good job, everyone. Well done on keeping your hands so nice and clean. We've now come to the time where we come and bring our pennies for Jesus. Have you got your pennies ready? I've got mine ready right here. Look, I've got my pennies ready and my penny pot. So I think it's time that you should go and get your pennies and your penny pots and we can do our offering together. Are you ready? Have you got your pennies? Then let's sing Hear the Pennies Dropping and come and bring your pennies for Jesus. Hear the pennies dropping penny pot. Well I've put them all of mine in so I think I should put the lid on mine. There we go. And let's sing a prayer over our offering. We're going to sing thank you for the world so sweet. So hands together, eyes closed and let's sing. Thank you for the world so sweet. Thank you good of you to come and bring your pennies for Jesus. Do you have a birthday this month? If you do, then stand up because we are going to sing you happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Jesus, my friend, may he guide you always. I... Think about a favorite gift your mom or dad has given you. Joseph's father gave him a special gift, and so did God. Joseph stuck his whole head down in the water. <laughs> he came up sputtering and laughing. The cool water felt so good. Taking care of sheep all day was a dusty business. Joseph shook his head back and forth. Little drops of water flew everywhere. Hey, watch what you're doing, his brother Reuben yelled at him. Where's my son Joseph? Jacob had many sons, but he loved his son Joseph the most. Father Jacob was old, and his young son gave him a lot of happiness. Joseph wasn't like his ten older brothers. They quarreled and sometimes caused their father lots of problems. But Joseph was gentle, and he always told the truth. He was full of joy, and he made his father smile. Joseph hurried to see what his father wanted. Jacob had a special gift for Joseph, a beautiful new coat. Made from many different colors, it was the kind a ruler or another special person might wear. Joseph slipped his arms into the coat. He ran his hand over the soft fabric. Thank you, Father, he whispered. He especially liked the bright colors. Joseph's big brothers frowned at him. Why was he so special? Why did he always get presents from their father? The jealous brothers grumbled among themselves. One night, Joseph had an unusual dream. The next day, he told it to his brothers. We were in the field tying bundles of wheat together. My bundle stood up, and your bundles of wheat bowed down to mine. Do you really think that we would ever bow down to you? His brothers scowled. Again, they grumbled among themselves. Later, Joseph had another dream. I saw the sun the moon, and eleven stars bowing down to me, he said. Father Jacob gently scolded Joseph. Do you really think that your mother and your brothers and I will bow down to you, he asked. No one understood what Joseph's dreams meant, 
but Father Jacob didn't forget. Years later, he would remember and understand. Joseph was blessed to receive many gifts from God. God blessed Joseph with the gift of dreams that he would one day understand. God guided Joseph's mind and gave him good thoughts. God loves you and blesses you with many gifts too. He gives you good thoughts. He will always help you do the right things. We've now come to the time in our program where we say our memory verse together. Have you learnt your memory verse for this month? Oh, you have. You're so good. Why don't we say it together? Our memory verse for this month is God. God written in red. Cares. Cares written in orange. Four. Four written in yellow. You. You written in green. And our memory verse this month can be found in 1 Peter 5 verse 7. 1 Peter 5 verse 7 written in blue. Clever job, everyone. You've learnt your memory verse. Shall we say our memory verse together after three? One, two, three. God cares for you. 1 Peter 5 verse 7. Let's say it again. God cares for you for you. First Peter 5 verse 7. Congratulations, we learnt our memory verse together. Let's all stand up and sing I'm glad I learnt my memory verse. Are you ready? I'm glad I learnt job. I'm so proud of you. Well done for learning your memory verse. Are you happy today? I hope that you're happy today. Put your hand up if you're happy today. Oh, there's lots of you that are happy today. And there's so many reasons to be happy today. You could be happy because of the weather. You could be happy because you've done something fun. I'm happy because my Lord and Saviour loves me very much and he always looks after me and that's one of the reasons I'm always happy. So I think we should sing a song about being happy. Let's sing If You're Happy and You Know It. Now there's lots and lots of actions to this song so I need you all to stand up and get ready to do all the actions with me. Let's sing If You're Happy and You Know It. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, nod your head. If you're happy and you know it, nod your head. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, nod your head. If you're happy and you know it, turn around. Whee! If you're happy and you know it, turn around.
so much fun today in Sabbath school, didn't we? We sang some songs, we had a great story, and we learned our memory verse. So I think what we should do is we should close our Sabbath school with a prayer. So hands together, eyes closed, and let's talk to Jesus and end our Sabbath school. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you that we had so much fun in Sabbath school today, learning all about you and being able to be together even though we're apart. Thank you, Father, for all that you do, and please continue to keep us safe and well until we meet again. In your name I pray, Amen. Our Sabbath school is over, let's sing, ready? Our Sabbath school is over and we are going to church. Goodbye, goodbye, remember God loves you. Goodbye. Today. It was so good to see you all and I hope that you continue to remain safe and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye!